as Richard Giacoba shows us how the city of Yonkers is trying to crack down on these businesses. Ever since recreational use of marijuana was made legal in New York State, smoke shops have been cashing in. But in the state's third largest city, it's become like the Wild West. Cannabis, vapes, and THC products are all being sold without a legal license to sell the products in New York State. Selling it illegal, you're going to have people underage buying it because it's illegal. You're probably not even asking for ID. The city smoke shop task force with Yonkers police confiscated more than $30,000 worth of illegal smoke products in September. And that resulted in the closure of seven smoke shops across Yonkers. These type of products look like they're marketed to kids. They have colorful packaging. They have colorful candies and gummies and stuff like that that might be attractive to kids. The crackdown comes as local emergency rooms in parts of the Hudson Valley are seeing more and more teens getting sick from eating gummies or vaping too much marijuana. Even though it's legal to smoke, but if you're going to sell it, you should have a license. City of Yonkers officials say of the seven smoke shops that have been shut down, three have reopened and four remain closed. Meanwhile, Mayor Mike Spano is introducing legislation that would hold business owners accountable for selling illegal marijuana. If a business owner has more than six offenses in one year, they would be subject to a shutdown and fined. A public hearing on that is set for two weeks. In Yonkers, Richard Giacobus, Fox 5 News.